Namaste, Dolsto. Mumbai prides itself on being perhaps the only city in India where the drivers use the meter. But there are still some cowboys here that you might have to deal with. So let me show you how to deal with them. But first, how not to deal with them. In Mumbai, you get in the rickshaw and the driver starts the meter. This is the norm there. Now tell me if this has happened to you in the comments. That one time that you don't check that the driver has started the meter, this happens. By law, all rickshaw drivers have to go by the meter in Mumbai, and when they do, I always tip them because coming from Delhi where meters aren't used, I really appreciate this. Most Maharashtrian drivers are so honest that they'll tell you not to tip, that you don't need to tip. Before you take a rickshaw here in India, just see what the meters look like. So this meter is running correctly, and this is what it looks like when the driver has it on waiting fee or for hire, meaning it's off. So if the driver won't use the meter, don't go with him. Ask him to stop and get out. He didn't want to stop for us, so we decided to pay the meter rate when we arrived. But now, as you're gonna see, you've got an argument on your hands, and I know most foreigners would just not go here and they would just pay whatever the driver was asking. But my wife's from Haryana and she knows the rules, so let's see how she handles it. Unfortunately, this wasn't a one-off either. See how we handle it in the next clip. This was during rush hour and there was a lot of traffic. So I kind of understand him wanting a bit more than the meter rate. At least we're not paying three times like that last guy was asking for. We got there and gave a tip, but Manisha wasn't so lucky and sometimes you just don't want to fight and spoil your mood. What happened? I had to pay 250. You paid 250? Why didn't you fight on it? We did. What? They didn't take oh, the meter? No. <laughs> I thought they always took the meter in Mumbai. That's what I heard. So to avoid all this hassle, just use ride sharing apps like Uber or Ola as often as you can. Rides aren't always available in Mumbai though, which is why we couldn't take Uber or Ola in those two cases. And uh, across the rest of India, you're going to have to bargain. So use Uber as an estimate. You can estimate how much the rickshaw driver will ask you for to go from A to B. 
So use that as a tool. Enjoy your time here in incredible India and Jai Hind.